Nope. <sighs> what is going on, everybody? T Gang back here with another video, and yep, you can tell I'm not as energized as I would usually be because the Nats just got their they just got smacked eleven nothing against the Orioles. Um, I don't even know what to say at this point. You're now four and six on the season. You know, not awful, but definitely could be playing better. Um, but before we get into this video, make sure you guys do like and subscribe. I posted another, you know, good one v one, and I know I haven't been playing the best competition lately. Um, I promise a better competition will be coming. Uh, more this way. Um, I'm going to the beach in like two days. I'm gonna do some one v ones there. You know, probably have some basketball courts. Probably one v one my cousin. All that stuff, but let's just hop right into it. So basically, Ani Ball Sanchez was on the mound tonight for us. He went five and a third inning. I think he gave up like four runs, and you know he didn't pitch bad at all. You know he didn't get any runs up for you know. It was just a tough night, and we got blown out. You know, we gotta we gotta win the next two games against the Orioles. I mean, you know, we're four and six. I would like to get to six and six. You know, by the end of the series, but who knows? We only had four hits tonight. I think Rob Robles had a hit, Howie had a hit, and then Castro had two hits. Soto didn't do anything. He was zero for four. Turner was 0 for 4, you know, Turner's been really struggling lately, and, you know, it's to the point where I'm kind of worried, but, you know, again, I'm, I'm gonna stay chill about it, um, but, who knows, and, yeah, I mean, the whole lineup just looked not really good tonight, um, but, I really legit have no words, we just, Made a lot of mistakes, and we got to learn from them. You know, um, it was just the, the Orioles, you know, they just played a good game, really. The offense, we got shut down, you know, it just, it can't happen anymore. We just played, you know, bad. Um, we really didn't even play that bad. It was really just the Orioles, like, we played clean baseball. We didn't really make any mistakes on the base running pass. We didn't make any errors. It was just the Orioles hit the ball. Good job for them. Good job to them. There's nothing we could have really done about it. And we lost. Can't win every game, you know. Still love this team right here. Um, you know, four and six, it's not awful. We gotta get on a hot streak. We gotta start rolling, you know. You know, we can't really be satisfied with where we are right now because we're not really we're not playing too good right now. Um you know, we've now lost two straight. It's not playing good. We we definitely gotta win the next two against the Orioles. Um, you know, the Orioles they just got swept by the Marlins. So, you know, the Orioles, I mean, they're definitely better than last year. I will give them that, but they're still the Orioles. We should be beating them. I don't get how we lost 11-0 today. It's embarrassing. You know, my family is Orioles fans, and I'm going to the beach with them, and uh, I want them in my face. So, we better win these next two games. Um, So, you know, but, you know, the bullpen, uh, you know, didn't do a good job. You know, it was the first time really this year. I'll give them a pass. It was the first time they really, you know, did bad this year. Um, but I also saw this, you know, saw that Doolittle's fastball has dropped like five miles an hour. That's not good. He, had, he used to average like 95 on his fastball. Now he averages 90.3. Yeah, that's not good. You know, we're just not looking too good. Again, we, you know, we, we had like four days off and then we had, an, then we played one game and two games and then we had another day off. So, you know, there can be a little rust expected, but that's no excuse. We got to play better. And, you know, I'm going to hold my team accountable. We just, we can't play like we, we did, you know, um, but, you know. It was just a bad, bad game we played. 
Um, I'm not sure who's on the mound tomorrow because uh, I feel like the rotation kind of got mixed up because Scherzer pitched and then Anibal Sanchez pitched. That kind of, it's kind of weird because Scherzer's the number one starter and Anibal's the number four. So I, I get it is a five starter pitch tomorrow or the Strasburg pitch tomorrow because Strasburg is also um, he's gonna be back. He's gonna be able to make his next start. And I also got some news on Scherzer. He said he doesn't expect uh, the the hamstring tweak to keep him from making his next starts. So that's definitely good, you know. That, now that everyone's healthy, but you know it's rare. All offense has been quiet since Soto since Soto has been back. It's not cause of Soto. It's not his fault. It's just you know, I don't know. It's just weird. But it was just you know not a fun game to watch. You know, it was hurt. I stopped watching when it was like seven nothing. Uh, I'll turn the Pelicans game on. So, yeah. <sighs> it was just not, it was a painful game to watch. You know, we had some opportunities. We, there was one where it was like 4 0. The base, we had the bases loaded with two outs. Couldn't do anything there. And we couldn't really do anything the whole game. So, kind of sucked to watch, but it was all right, you know. Got to get these next two games, you know, to improve the 6-6. Six and six. Let's see if we can do it. But anyways, it's going to wrap it up for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Keep up the support, and I'm out.